New details in the case of a man accused of threatening to kill a local lawmaker. A political opponent of State Representative Jose Felix Diaz says he's willing to represent that man. That attorney sat down with CBS 4's Vanessa Boards this afternoon to explain why he would want to take on the case. She joins us live from Turner Guilford Correctional Facility in West Miami-Dade, where the man accused of making the threats is still behind bars. Right, Vanessa? Yes, he is. He's on $500,000 bond. And actually, that attorney and opponent of Representative Diaz says that's ridiculous. The bond should not be $500,000. And that's why he wants to represent him. Marco Rubio, Nelson Diaz, Manny Diaz, Manny Diaz Jr., Carlos Jimenez. 34-year-old Steve St. Felix appeared in court yesterday and ranted about other local Republicans during a hearing to evaluate his mental health. St. Felix was arrested two days ago after he allegedly posted this on Facebook on Sunday. I'll kill your expletive if you show up at the next Republican executive committee meeting. Miami attorney Lorenzo Palomares says he's willing to represent St. Felix pro bono. You want to represent Steve St. Felice who essentially threatened your opponent in the Senate primary. Why? I, I basically said that I'd be honored to represent him pro bono. And the reason being is that I believe that what Mr. Diaz did was a publicity stunt uh, because he, he's presumed to know the law. Palomares also just so happens to be running against Jose Felix Diaz in the Senate primary for District 40. There was no reasonable expectation of uh, fear by Mr. Diaz, and what they're doing is using uh, Mr. Uh, San Felix for political purposes. Palomares believes Representative Diaz made the threat a bigger issue than it was because he wants attention ahead of a July 25th primary. You're claiming that he's trying to get, that Representative Diaz is trying to get free publicity, but aren't you doing the same by saying that you will represent St. Felix pro bono? Well, yes and no. I am a member of the bar. Uh, I'm a constitutional attorney, and I don't believe that there was a crime here committed. So if somebody wrote on Facebook, I will kill you if I see you the next time, Lorenzo, you won't see that as a threat? No, 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 just block them. That's all you have to do, block them. And Lorenzo says he hasn't heard from St. Felix and his family to represent him. He's waiting for that call. We also called Representative Diaz to get a response. He hasn't called us back yet. Reporting live at TGK, Vanessa Borge, CBS 4 News. Vanessa, thank you. Now